Well, hey there, people. Well, I received another product uh, to do a review on. Uh, this time it's a camouflage net. Um, it's from a company called Outerdo. Anyway, uh, let's take it outside and see what it's all about. Well, I guess summer's over. It's uh, minus one Celsius right now. Uh, the other night it hit minus seven Celsius. So yeah, it's done. Anyway, uh, let's have a look at this net. Well, anyway, it looks like Cash is gonna help me with this one. Um, this is the packaging, pretty compact. It's uh, six by six by nine feet. Anywho, uh, you wanna grab that? Anyway, let's open it up and have a peek. Wow, I lost it. I took it out of the bag and I just couldn't find it. And I finally found it. Well, there it is in all its glory. Comes with little ropes so you can tie it to the trees or whatever you want to tie it to. As in make a wicked blind, good duck blind. Six foot six by nine feet. Well, I flipped it on its back and um, yeah, it's reinforced with all this rope. So it seems to be pretty good quality. I had to go in the house for a few seconds and I came out and I can't find it. The thing is too good for its own good. Oh, there it is. Okay. Whew. There's my gate before. And there it is now. It's like the gate was never there. So maybe I should camo all of my fence throughout my whole fence. That would look pretty sharp. Where'd my wheelbarrow go? Where'd my dog go? <laughs> okay, guys. Get here, buddy. Exactly, exactly. Oh, you're <laughs> Cruelty to animals right there. Hey buddy. <laughs> he loves it. Yeah. yeah you love it. You love it. She's still here. <laughs> yeah, she didn't go nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> well, unfortunately, it's that time of year again. I had to put the bike away. Uh, I went to start it. Battery's dead. I'm going to tear down this wall again and I'm gonna shove her in here. Pull the trike out. Clean up this mess. And the bike will go right in there with the other bike. Yeah, these tires, they came with the house, like they've been in the shed forever. Like they're fairly decent tires, so I should be able to get 50 bucks on Kijiji for those maybe. Don't know, I'll try. It's battery issue day today. The Ford's battery, I don't know, it started spewing, spitting out juice. Uh, luckily I had a spare battery in the garage, that's, or the shed, whatever, that's still good. Uh, I just gotta clean up the cables, look how bad. Nasty. And I gotta give it a charge. Hey buddy. You're so good staying in the yard. So it's been what, way over a year and I still haven't got hinges to make this door wider. Anyway, let's take that down. There we go. Well I just gotta charge the battery and then I'll take it for a little ride around the, uh, the racetrack here at the tractor dealership. Okay, where'd my bike go? Two dead batteries. I wonder if this battery's dead. I haven't been on it for a long time. I guess we'll find out in a sec. Huh? I guess the battery's not dead on this guy. Okay, this is not funny at all. Like, where did my trike go? Come on. Yeah, I didn't have patience to charge the battery fully, I just gave it a boost. Good old trike saves the day again. But I will put the charger on it before winter. I should take the battery out of it is what I should do. That's what I'm going to do. Well, I didn't get out too much, but every time I got out on her, she was fun. Anyway, I guess it's time to put her to bed. I'm going to throw her in a little shed here.
I gotta get some gas conditioner before I really put it away for the winter. I took it for a ride down the, the raceway here, it was fun. Yeah, I'm surprised nobody called the police on me. I was going around and around and around and around. It was a good time. Well, I got her in the shed. Um, well, Graham's coming by tomorrow, so I'm gonna wait for him. And we're gonna back it into that room there. This is a heavy pig, this guy. Girl, guy, whatever. Heavy. Yeah, I'm not having a very good day. I put the charger on the truck battery overnight and it's still not charged. Turns out that my charger is busted now. Anyway, I, I boosted it and I got it started. I went to the mailbox, came back, heard a noise, opened the hood, uh, antifreeze is coming out the cap. Hopefully it's just the cap. Um, but anywho, I have a doctor's appointment and uh, I don't want to risk overheating or whatever is going on with this thing, so I borrowed uh, Kiefer's Versa. Make my... All right. So I decided to make myself a little blind in the bush here. That's what I was intended for, right? See if you can see me behind it. It would help if I was wearing camel. Anyway, that's what we're, uh, we're out here hunting for nothing. Right on, people. Thanks a lot for watching. I really do appreciate it. I uh, will talk to you guys later. What's going on here, Shelly? What? You doing a little cooking, are you? <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Because it's my idea to do stuffed mushrooms. So I got the mushrooms ready. I'm getting this ready. And you're going to fry this up. And then I'll get the cream cheese ready and we can mix it all together and put it in the yeah. oven. Garlic. The stems from the mushrooms and red pepper. What's that in there? That's butter. I'm going to butter the, them so they don't dry out. Ah. Yeah. So is that uh, cream cheese going in the mushrooms or on top or what? Um, or you all, mix in the... You mix it yeah. all up with the cool. cream cheese and put right. it inside. You stuff them with it and then put cheddar over top to melt. Okay. With a steak. Doing a little painting area. Yeah. <laughs> Well, this way they don't dry up, right? When they bake. I didn't know that. It's a little helpful hint I got off the internet. There you go. Yeah. You're putting some in the hole? A little bit. <laughs> That's what she said. Ah. It smells good. I guess I should start up on my steak soon, no? Are you cooking the steak too? No, you're cooking the steak. You gotta season it. Yeah. I'm almost done here, so. Yeah. Well, you're gonna put those in the oven, right? Yeah. How long do you figure? Not long. Twenty minutes, maybe. Oh uh yeah. -huh. Okay. Oh, no, they're mushrooms. Half an hour. Steaks on. I was gonna barbecue, but it's pretty crappy out. You got all your mixtures together. Yeah. Those smoke them. Though. A little raw for my taste, but... Me too. Too raw? Yeah. Okay. What do you want? Medium? Medium raw. Well, it's ready. How good does that look? Jolly. 